Let's see if fortune favours the brave. Hey guys, welcome back to Detroit. I wasn't going to do a race today. I was going to do a video on drop rounds and what the drop rounds mean at the end of the season and how you can actually progress through the championship towards the last few weeks of a championship of a season. But I realize I've already done it. <laughs> so go check the video out up there. I'll leave a link. It's um, I dribble on a little bit in the middle, but yeah, the start and the finish is exactly the information I wanted to portray. So um, yeah, go check that out. I don't have to worry about drop rounds here in the Skippy, but in the Formula Sprint, it's there's a couple of races left and I need to get a few more points to get into the top 14 in the world. So that would be pretty cool. We're doing the Skippies today and we're... I just need to focus on bravery and overall times. These guys are seriously fast. We've got 5,000 I rating guys in there. Really high strength of field. And I'm off the pace. I just need to get closer to the walls. And I was just watching Dennis Johansson, his stream. And the way he drives is insane. So many gear changes. Ooh. Good luck, everyone. 14 laps. The track temp is... 38 Celsius. All right, Glenn, be ready. Watch for the lights. Go, go, go. So we just take it easy to start off with. Robert starting in the pits. This guy's car six, so I'm guessing he's got pace up his sleeve. You Off you go, buddy. You For me, I lost a lot of time. Starts okay. We're still in good shape here. Looking in the mirrors. And I'm glad I didn't start in the pits because look at Brad, Robert. He's um. Nearly 20 seconds away. Nice, nice, Jack, nice. Sorry, I just didn't see you there. <laughs> the gap in front is now 0.8. So we'll let these guys sort themselves out, let the field cleanse a little bit, try and avoid crashes. But yeah, Dennis, he like drops the clutch there. There's an incident in turn seven. It looks like Bradshaw. Oh, he's off. Mark, you really need to buy me dinner first if you're gonna get back close to my asshole. <laughs> Point five off. That's another video I want to do. The virtual mirror can be very deceiving as to how close the car can be. Well, he's hit the wall. I've really enjoyed the challenge of committing to this track, to learning it more than anything. I think the Skippy is a good place to learn it because the track itself is so bumpy that the car like the F3 or the, even the USF 2000 uh, I've got damage. is very stiff. Oh. So having that suspension trouble sort of Nearly followed him. A bit more forgiving. Not for him, but...
fitting in, fitting in. That's a long race. The leader has just done a 144.81. Come on, knackers. Come on, buddy. Well, the field's cleansing slowly. Those guys have uh, gonna have to pit at least. There's an incident in turn seven. Shit, George, I got the clear there. There's an incident in turn six. We think it might be Cabrera. Incident in turn 11. Dennis, did you see that or not? Yep, saw it. Got damage rear wing. The leader has just done a 144.28. Fastest lap for Alonso, 144.28. I won't be doing fours, but I want to be doing low fives by the end of the race. B12, that was a 148.24. Yep, but we're in 12. I thought Christopher might be damaged. The gap ahead is now 1.4. That's not the case. Sorry, Hero. I thought it was clear there. We're getting that a bit today. <laughs> Incident in, turn eight. There's an incident in, turn nine. Come on, Matthews. Keep your wits about you, mate. Come on, knackers. Be brave. That lap was a 146.12. The guy behind has just done a 144.30. And it just comes down to bravery, really. Thanks, Richard. Closer to the wall, Green Delta. These guys are going faster. <laughs> but come on, knuckers.
be here very soon, Christopher. Decreased to 2.0 seconds. Oh, I know, oh, I know. New fastest lap for Alonso 143.83. Marks out. Alonso is now leading. E11. That was a 5.9. I don't know I'm better than that. Go on the inside, crust above. Inside, buddy. Inside. Car left. Clear left. Oh, Glenn. Come Easy, on, Tiger. Position. Mark's next. Fastest lap for Alonso. 143.40. Come on, knackers. Second off in sector one. Sector two is 0.7. Oh, Robin and crew Sector three is 1.7 seconds off the pace. The gap in front is increasing. It's now 1.0 seconds. So it was Louie, it's my um, the person I'm really racing. chances here. Let's make sure we can take them. That lap was a 145.22. That's your quickest lap in this session. 2.7 to Louis now. 45.2. That's the best I've done this week. Let's see if Louis gives up the ghost. Three to mark. 
they commit so much to these corners. Two seconds to Louis. Two point nine to Mark. The guy behind's catching the gaps now. Two point eight. He's quicker than you in two. Turn seven. Crystal balls flying. <laughs> Size so mark behind me. Come on, knackers. Sectors one and two are 0 0.7 off the pace. Sector three is 0 0.6 off the pace. Five zero, not bad. For me anyway. We think P five has been there in turn six. But he's still racing. I think P5 has been to in turn seven. There's an incident in turn eight. Come on, Knackers. One point six. So this lap push now the game one just next it. one. We're gonna lose one. So a top 10 against these guys I'd be happy with.
Take the right, mate. Get the car right. Hold your line. Hold your line. Clear to the right. Don't give up. Keep him under pressure. Focus, knuckers, 1.8. The gap in front is now 1.0 seconds. Come on, Nakos, 1.4. We'll be right. Two, seven. Come on, There we go. I think that's my first 44 for the week. Two to go. Two to go. That lap time was 144.79. Finally a 44. That feels like something. The guy behind has just done a 143.36. Come on, Nakas. And that's cleansed again. Mark's got through Davies and Louie. Nothing stupid, come on. Faster, white flag. These guys have found some pace as well. The gap ahead is now 1.6 seconds. White flag, Saber. That lap was a 1.44. Let's go for it, Nakis. Come on. That's your quickest today. 1.5.
it for. It's not enough, but I'm really happy with today. See if we can pick up any white flag freebies. I'm guessing not. <sighs> that was a relatively clean race. Well done, guys. With my best lap on at the end. V12. That's it. We're done. No, I'm happy with that. Bueno, buena carrera. So if you have a look at it now. I don't know how you guys are hitting 43s all the time. It is super, super fast. Well done. I'm just, to be honest, I'm happy with that. It was my laps. So there was one lap where I let Mark through and did a 45.5. And I'm like, that was faster than my laps, fastest laps in other races. It's all about, for me, getting rid of those nerves, just committing, and just more time you spend with it. There's like a pendulum effect with the car, so when you turn it in, there's like this, I, the only way I can describe it is a pendulum effect. And it's getting that confidence up so that the pendulum effect- I still apologize to Rior, but uh, yeah, it was a pretty clean move-ish. I just hit the curb and jumped a bit on the, to the left. And then after that, it wasn't a matter of following, it was just like seven, 44, 790, 781, then a 578. So the pace came, but too late. And um, yeah, really, really happy with that. But yeah, go check out the drop round video because um, it's pretty good if you ask me. <laughs> and I managed to squeeze a point in within 11 minutes. Not often can I do that. Wow. 32-46 strength of field. Dennis ended up finishing third. I never look at him. What is it? Race driver 77, I think it's called, on Twitch. And the way he changes, far out. Extremely fast. But for our efforts today, we only lost two I rating. We gained 10 safety rating. I didn't get as many points as other races, but like I said, my pace, much better. Thanks for watching, guys. Thumbs up if you liked it. Down if you didn't. Make sure you subscribe. Check me out on Twitch when I eventually get there. And I'll see you next time. Bye.